So today, I'm gonna teach you how to make a simple web browser. So, first, find the SDK tool in. I'm gonna download it in Play Store, Mobile Genie, for Mobile Market. Um, easy. So first, let's create a new project for, let's use the Eclipse, so this one, then let's name it Simple Browser, Simple O Browser. So, let's name the package as com that tutorial tutorial that your name or your company name or your music name or your what you want so it's great first delete this text view okay second delete the linear layout Okay, let this one. This. Then replace linear layout with web view. Then instead of orientation, make it ID. So at last ID slash web view. So let's save this. So in the main activity, let's create a private web view. Private web view. Then same it um My value, then this one. So in the on create, at my value, the two balls as inside of parentheses. Then find you by ID. So R that ID that web view. That web view is from this main XML. So save it. Next create my web view that get settings settings. Okay. That Set JavaScript enable. So, then, so the first part of it. So, Okay, let's delete it in that one so my web view that load load URL okay so HTTP so slash slash www dot google dot com for example okay so like that so create a new client by creating a new class private class okay 
Arit pas. Mai. Mai. Well. Fine. Then expense. Well. Fine. Web. View. In this client, make this app override public void like that. So, should okay, boolean. I'm not sure if it's boolean or void, but it should be override. Should over. Okay, it's boolean. It's, vo it's void. Alright, you are L loading. So, okay. Make it a web. Have you? Then this return super must be gonna create it as web view that load URL. Then URL. This one. Then return. Save this one. My web view that set web view client, then new my web view client. This one, so on, then okay. So see this. So let's view the files, then search for Android Manifest. So in the manifest, look to the end. Before the ending of the manifest, then create a new uses permission. Okay, this one. Then Android name is equal to Android that permission that internet all cops lock. Oh, I'm sorry. Then close. So let's save this. So, what we're gonna test it if it is working. So, first let's do this one, then compiling, texting. So, look, simple web browser. If you want to install this application, you will get access to device access, the phone network access because of the Android minus manifest so let's install then done then let's open our WLAN. so this one is a simple web browser so let's open it so wait wait until so I have a Wi-Fi, but I don't, did not connect. Okay, it's because of the fucking cleanester. So, okay, so he says that my Wi-Fi is not in range, but in order to get an access, you need an internet. Okay. 
So, this one, I have my Wi-Fi. So, okay, it's connecting. So, sorry, it's authenticating. And what we're gonna do next, it will authenticate and connect and okay. So now I'm not, now that I'm connected, so let's restart the application. Look, that's this one, the Google. Okay. So, in order for us to make it like a true web browser, so let's go to our SDK tool, then the Android manifest. So, in activity, let's add Android. Team equals add Android slash style at Android colon style slash team that no tie so so note, note this one, note the Android style theme, no title bar, then note that, then let's run this one. So let's run. Now let's see if it's working. Install, then let's open it. So as you can see, there's no more title bar. It's only the Google. Okay, you can search. Search for... So start casting. Then images. You can make it on. You can search for the image. Okay. Oh, straight. So let's see. As you can see, we cannot view this images. Okay, now we can view the images. So what happened if we click this back button? Oh, it's only get back to this. So we'll work with it. So we're gonna go like this. Um, at override public boolean on down. So okay, it's on key down. So first, if Key code is equals key event that key code back. So search for the key code back. So back. Okay. Key code back. And end. My review tap 
can go back. Alright. So now where you that go back. Return. So now let's save and run this application once again. So open this one more. Then we're gonna search. So in the Google we're gonna search again for the images. Then what is gonna do the script? Another search for the script. Now when you click the image, so the click this one. So click down the back button, then it go back. Click. 